Hi, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and I'm excited that you're here with me today for my February empties. These are the empties that I've been amassing for maybe the past three months. These will show you the products that I use and love on a daily basis. Okay, let's get down to this and I have quite a few of them and they're in no particular order. The first is this Nature Well Retinol Cream and if you've been watching my channel, you know that I've been using this for the past year. I keep this in the shower and after I towel off, I just use one little spritz of this and that's enough to do my arms, my legs, and my torso, and it's very reasonable, and it does contain retinol, so it's actually good for your skin. Now, the second item here is actually not an empty. In fact, it's a fully. I bought not one, but two of these, and this is the Batiste Instant Hair Refresh Dry Shampoo, and I saw another YouTuber just rave about this to the extent that I went ahead and bought two of them. Although they call this a dry shampoo, this one sprays in your hair kind of wet, and it took it a long time to dry, and I just never did get why that YouTuber really liked this, so this one is being Pitched. Now I will show you what I love and this is the dry shampoo that I've been using for years. This is the Suave Professionals brand. It says it's keratin infused. I don't know really what that has to do with things or if it really makes much of a difference, but I love this little Suave dry shampoo because it goes into your hair very dry. It just kind of puffs it up. It gives day old hair that new look again, gives it a little more body. I love this dry shampoo. This is the Bath & Body Works Shower Gel. However, I won't be repurchasing this scent, which is the Pear Berry. I didn't really like this. I use this in the shower every morning when I take a shower, and I use those little scruffly kind of spa gloves, and I just put some of this between the gloves. About one big spritz will do it for almost my whole body. And then you just clean your body off with it, and these wonderful Bath & Body Works Shower Gels just have a wonderful scent. The reason I don't like the pear berry, it smells good enough, but I really prefer the lemon or the lime ones. And I don't remember the name of the one that I especially like, but I will post it below for you because the lemon and lime scents actually are scientifically proven to make us happier. And I really like that extra endorphin boost in the shower every morning, but these are wonderful and just choose your scent and go for it. I absolutely love this John Frieda Luxurious Volume Touchably Full Conditioner. And I had the shampoo that went with it, but unfortunately I threw that bottle away. Who knew on YouTube you had to keep your trash? Oh well. But actually, I mix this with the Sally's Beauty Shampoo, the number one and number two, the Nutriox Shampoo and Conditioner, and I use this right along with it. I believe the Nutriox is helping my hair grow in, and I believe these products are helping my hair look fuller. Now, I mentioned trying to get my hair to grow in, and for a while there, I was seeing a lot of patchy areas on the top of my scalp, which I was not liking, so I started using the Women's Rogaine, and I used this for a while. I think this is my second bottle, but this was messy and a little difficult to use. And I used this for a couple of months and I noticed that I was getting the fine little baby hairs growing in. But when I went to my cosmetologist and asked her what she had seen over the 30 years that she's been in the business, and she said, well, really, the only thing I've seen it do is to grow in the fine baby hairs. She really had not seen the hair produced from Rogaine to end up being long and normal hair. So I decided to make the switch from this to this, which is the part three of the Nutriox system from Sally's Beauty. And this is B vitamins, it's a biotin treatment. And I've seen a lot of YouTubers have very good results with this. And this is actually my second bottle. I've just purchased my second bottle. This lasted probably about 45 days. They say this bottle lasts 30 days, but my experience was that it lasts longer. How you use this is after you shampoo your hair and you towel dry it, you go ahead and just spritz this in the areas that you really want to grow and you rub it in for 30 seconds or a minute, something like that. And I do that each time I shampoo and I am noticing that my hair is growing in thicker. This is the Frizz Ease three day straight. And actually I think I've only been using this one for about three years, but ever since I've been flat ironing my hair, this is a wonder worker. If you flat iron your hair, all you do is after you've towel dried your hair, you just spritz this all the way through it, give it a little brush out, and then blow dry it, and then go ahead and use your flat iron. And literally, this makes your flat ironed hair last for two to three days. It really keeps your style looking good, and it gets rid of the frizzies. I can't recommend this product highly enough. Now, here's something I use in the bathroom quite a lot of the time, and this is this Bath & Body Works Stress Relief Candle. It smells like a spa. It is absolutely beautiful. And I really, really like strong candles, and this is a very strong candle. A lot of people will buy this and use it all throughout their home. 
I particularly like it in the bathroom, but I think it's a wonderful candle and it really does add to my enjoyment of life. Now, here's something that I use to keep the colds and flu away and it really works beautifully. This is the Neomed Sinus Rinse. I've mentioned this before in a favorites, but I did want to let you see that I am actually using it. In fact, I just got another kit. Every now and then I replace the kit because I don't want germs to grow. And so I'm going to be throwing this one away. What you do is they give you salt packets. I think it's 50 salt packets and you put the salt in here and then you put water in it and shake it up. And it's really hard to do, but you kind of shoot the water up into your sinuses and then do the other side. And then you take what's left and kind of gargle it. The minute I start to feel a sore throat or feel a cough coming on, I start to use this. And really most of the time it takes the sickness away and I feel great again. Now, before I get into my final skincare items, I'll show you three little items, which I absolutely love. The first is this little elf brow pencil and it's in the color taupe. And I accidentally threw the last one away, but I've actually purchased two of them. Here's the second little one that I purchased. These are phenomenal and they are only $2. And I was using the little Anastasia brow pencil and I still do like that. However, I really think I like this one better. It's got a little spoolie on one side. And then on this side, it's got a little bit of a brow pencil right there and it's a thicker end. So it's very, very easy to fill in large areas like at the front of your brow and my missing tails. It really helps with that. Love this brow pencil. And two other throwaways that I had was the CoverGirl Clean, which is an eye makeup remover. I absolutely love this. I have used this for about 20 years. It says makeup remover for eyes and lips, and it is absolutely phenomenal. It's just a basic oil that takes every trace of your eye makeup off, and I suppose your lips too, although I don't use it for that. Great little eye makeup remover. And the next item I have is the CarePost. And that is a lash lengthener, which I absolutely love. I have used this on and off for years. Every now and then it seems to stop working and so I'll switch to something else for a while, but I always go back to this. I'm using it on this eyelash and I'm testing another lash lengthener on this one. And I'm going to be having a video in the future to tell you which product wins the race, but I really do love this product. And I think it's only like 12, $14, somewhere in there. And it's a generic for Latisse and it really works. Now the last products I have are skincare items. And these are the Oil of Olay Regenerous products and they are well used. It's the Micro Sculpting Cream and the Micro Sculpting Serum. I have probably gone through two bottles of these because everybody says you should use moisturizer and I think Angie of Hot and Flashy used these or used these, one or the other. And I just didn't find that my skin looked very good using these. When I used them, my skin turned about as red as this bottle and it just looked kind of puffy and inflamed. I just don't like what moisturizer does for my skin and I use so many serums and Retin-A and so many products that I just don't think I need these so I won't be replacing them. Now, these are the products that I do use and I won't go into all the serums I use. Um, I've got that in some skincare videos. There are two bottles that are emptied from the Timeless Vitamin C Serum, which is the C plus E plus Ferulic Acid Serum. I can hardly say that. I really, really like these products. Vitamin C is wonderful. I use it in the morning, put it all over my face, and it really does start to get rid of hyperpigmentation and it protects you from the sun. I've been experimenting with the Ordinary's Vitamin C product and so far I like it. I'll let you know in the future which one wins. This is a good product, but it costs around $25 and the Ordinary's product is about $6 and so I'm hoping that I like it better. And this is another empty from Timeless. This is the Coenzyme Q10 Serum, and I've been using this for about the past 10 months. Coenzyme Q10 is an antioxidant that helps your skin fight aging, it helps decrease wrinkles, and helps your skin function more like younger skin. Now I have one other skincare product that's probably the most important one I use, and that is a good sunblock. And this is the Australian Gold SPF 50, and it's a really nice sunblock because you can use it under makeup and it does not cause your makeup to pill. If you're not using Retin-A, I would really recommend one of those Neutrogena Dry Touch sunblocks. But if you're using Retin-A, you need a non-chemical sunscreen. And this is a great sunscreen for that. It works wonderfully under your makeup and it does not cause your foundation to pill up, which I really like. I have already repurchased this. Now, my final product is a pan and I never even tried these. And ladies, I'm telling you, the power of other YouTubers to make me buy just has no bounds. I don't know who recommended this and I apologize if I'm forgetting you, but this is the Mizone Snail Recovery Gel Cream. And I must have been very impressed because I ordered not one, but two little bottles of this stuff. I have to say the minute I got it in the mail from Amazon, I thought snail recovery gel, there's snails in here. And I thought that just seems very mean to smush up snails for my skincare cream. And I couldn't really get to the point that I would put this stuff on my face. So I have no idea if this works or not, but I am not going to be trying it out. Okay, if you're not a subscriber, I hope you'll go ahead and subscribe. That way you won't miss any of my future videos on skincare and makeup for us 50 plus beauties. 
Now, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day, and I'm going to be using the Life Loves You cards from Louise Hay. Let's go ahead and choose one. What does God have in store for us today to think about? Oh, this is a good one. I live in a friendly universe. I live in a friendly universe. Let life befriend you today. Every hour on the hour throughout the day, remind yourself, I live in a friendly universe. I absolutely love this card. And you know, in my first half, I think I ran around kind of scared half the time and thinking that things were gonna work out negatively and just being very negative in general. Now, in my second half, I realize that time is a very important commodity and I don't wanna miss a minute feeling negative about my life or my circumstances. And it helps me to realize that I live in a friendly universe, a universe that supports me. So friends, as you're going through your day to day, I hope you remind yourself all throughout the day that this is a friendly universe and it's there to support you, uphold you, and help your dreams come true. Take care. See you next time.